Welcome back everybody to JB Sports Cards. Today we'll be going over uh, some cards that I've gotten in the mail over the past couple of months. And we'll let you know what I think about them. And let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Like, subscribe, share, and let's get to it. All right, so let's get to it. So I'll show you uh, some of the pickups that I've gotten recently from shows in the mail. And you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below. First one, we got a Topps Chrome Rookie, Kyle Schwarber, on card, uh, signed on card auto rookie card. And it is number to 150. So that's pretty nice. Kyle Schwarber on card, Topps Chrome, looks like a blue refractor. Uh, next up, we have a 2021 Stadium Club, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Nice on-card auto. Uh, not as rookie, but nonetheless, it's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. It's a on-card auto. It's pretty full. Just that thin line right there, but it's not faded like a lot of his ours. So it's pretty good. And then we next up we have a 2020 Tops Finest Moments. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. I think this auto um, is much nicer even than the last one. Goes all the way through. No faded. The line's a lot more full. Enclosed by Tops. So uh, that was a nice pickup at a show. Um, I, I don't do much with SGC, but I couldn't pass up this deal for how much I paid for this. So this is a premier level. Uh, those aren't that familiar with uh, Select. Uh, they have Concourse, I believe, which is the lowest. Then it goes Premier, Club, then Field level. So this is like the second tier of his Select rookie card. And it is a 9.5. It's not a perfect 10 from SGC, but it's a 9.5, and it didn't cost me that much, so I couldn't pass it up. I'm a huge fan of Justin Herbert. Um, not really a fan of the team, but a fan of his. I think he's a great quarterback, and he will be for a very long time, and I just like, I kind of like Select more than Prism. Lower pop counts, and uh, I'll do a video about that too later on to talk about SGC and PSA and even pr the difference between Prism, Select, and Optic. At least what are my thoughts on it. So that'll be a different video. Uh, this is a 2015 Inception Kyle Schwarber Prospect Autographs. This is an on-card auto. It is, um, one of, it's not really his, his Bowman rookie. He has an actual, like a first Bowman. But this isn't far from it. Uh, it is a Gem Mint 10. And it's a pretty nice card. Picked it up from a show. For fairly cheap. And he's killing the ball, so. Highly suggest to jump on uh, Kyle Schwarber train when you can. Uh, next up is a 2017 Bowman Chrome Aaron Judge batting. I think this is one of his best looking rookie cards. It's him batting what he does best it is a rookie card it's not his first bowman but um it is one of his rookies so i picked this one up this one has been going up on market mover so if you have that app check it out uh this one has been going up pretty significantly uh during baseball season now that we're in the postseason baseball season has settled down some and you just have to hold on to these uh, types of cards till next year so march when spring training starts things will start going back up uh We'll get to my top three pickups here. Uh, now, this being probably one of my number one pickups the past couple months. Um, I do like to select, like I said. This one is his Concourse, I believe. Yep, it says Concourse right there. So this is basically his base, but if you look at the pop counts for select in 2018 compared to his 2018 Prism, this is the way you want to go with the select. There's almost 18,000 PSA 10s of his Prism Rookie. There's less than 10% of these uh, in Select. In the concourse, there's not even 1,700 of these. It's like 1,600 something. 
So if you guys listen to Ken Golden, if you know who he is, he knows a lot about sports cards. Um, you know, in his videos, he tells you to go after the lower pop counts. And that's what I do. That's what I try to do anyway. So I think a long-term investment, lower pop counts is the way to go. I mean, who's going to want to pay $1,500 for a card that's got 30,000 of them? That's just me, though. It's my opinion. You guys can comment down below. Let me know what you think. This is, I would say, right there along with my number one pickup, uh, Justin Herbert. This is another select. Uh, this is his rookie. And if you look on the back, this is his field level. So besides the silver or any color variations, this is the hardest select Herbert to get. So um, it was well worth it, uh, what I got it for. I think it'll just go up from here. Uh, definitely not down, low pop count, very low pop count because it's his uh, field level, so there's not that many of them. Uh, so I picked up this Justin Herbert Select field level. And then last but not least, um, we're also going to talk about a giveaway at the end of this video, so stay tuned for that. Uh, there will be a free giveaway uh, coming up within the next month, and I'll let you know what the prize is here at the end of this video, so stay tuned. But here's my third, I think my third best pickup uh, recently. I think this guy is probably one of the most underrated players in Major League Baseball, Rafael Devers. Uh, he is in the ALCS. He's on the Boston Red Sox. He's doing well. He has been all year, and nobody really talks about him. Why? I have no idea, but he's very underrated, and he's a great ball player, and I think this card will keep going up. The pop count's not that high. Um, once people catch on to Devers, this is one of his cards that you want to get. So it's his first Bowman Chrome, and yeah, it's not his refractor, but you know, like I said, it's still a low pop count. So there's that one. And you guys are probably thinking, wow, this guy's like a PSA snob. I just like PSA. I, I always have. Um, I like their slabs. So, yep, that's it. It's my top three pickups. And now for the giveaway in the next uh, month or so, in the next four weeks, because I am going on a little vacation. In the next four weeks, I will be giving away this Project, Project 70 Tops Tatis. Junior. So all you, all you have to do is like, subscribe, share. Um, at least, you know, if you dislike the video, that's fine. But uh, yeah, subscribe and uh, comment down below. Those are really the only the two things that I really ask of you is just to, you know, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think uh, in this video and subscribe to the channel if you already haven't. So I will be picking a lucky winner uh, randomly uh, between the comments and the subscribers and I will ship this card to you for free of charge you will win this tops project 70 by Lauren Taylor Fernando Tatis jr. hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys again soon